If you use Calendly for booking appointments, then you can actually embed it directly into your Linktree page so people can actually book an available time slot with you without leaving your Linktree page. And I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. So just before we start, I want to give you a quick heads up that I'm using the free version of Linktree and the free version of Calendly in this video. So if you have the pro version of either one, then you may have extra options available to you. So once you've logged into your Linktree account, click on the add link button at the top here. We now need to try and find Calendly. So click on the view all button here underneath and then scroll down until you get to the section called grow your following and Calendly should be in this top section here. If it's not there, then click on view all in the bottom corner here to expand the list and Calendly will be in there. So once you've found Calendly, click on add and it will open up the section in your link tree here. So the first thing you need to do is give it a title such as schedule an appointment, make a book a, a call with me, that kind of thing. So I'm just going to put book a discovery call with me. Then you want to grab the URL link from the actual booking page that you want to use from your Calendly account. So if you go into your Calendly account, click on copy link for the actual booking page that you want to use. Then just paste that into where it says URL here and the link is there. So if you scroll down a bit, you can see there's a purple button here that's highlighted. This is actually the settings to, for the Calendly link. You've got two options. You can either have it so that the user will go directly to the link itself, which opens up in a new tab, or you can embed your actual Calendly calendar on your Linktree page. You can see that the button here is switched to on as it's green which means that over in the preview on the right hand side here you can see that the actual link is live now. So I've got it set to go directly to the URL so if we click on here it will open up in a new tab and that's what it looks like the booking page will open up in a new tab on your browser. If you want to embed it actually in your Linktree page so that people can book the appointment within your page then click on embed your calendar on your link tree and now when you click on the button here over on the preview it will actually open up the booking page within the link tree page and you can go through and select the appointment that way. Now on my link tree page you can see that each of my links here all have an icon uh, like a thumbnail icon to the left of them so I want the same for this one here as well for the Calendly one so to do that I click on the thumbnail icon here then I choose set thumbnail and this is where you can either upload your own image or you can choose from the icons available. So I'm just going to choose from the icons and I'm going to do a search for calendar and click the one I want to use. And now you can see on the preview here on the right hand side that I've now got the calendar icon next to where it says book a discovery call with me. To get back to the Calendly options of choosing whether you want to embed them or not, just click on the settings icon which is over on the left hand side here click on there and it will open up the Calendly options again for you. So to view your actual Linktree play page, click on share in the top right corner and go down to open my Linktree. This will open up in, on a, in a new tab so you can see it full screen. And this is what it looks like. So when people click on there, it opens up the Calendly booking page and they can then go through and select a time that they like they can click on description and it gives the short description that you've put on your booking page, enter their details and book a call with you. So what do you think? Will you be adding your Calendly booking page to your Linktree? Let me know in the comments. And if you want to know how to embed videos into your Linktree page like I have here, then you'll want to watch this video next. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye for now.